In this video, I am going to try and survive a hundred day as the Amargosaurus on Path of Titans official servers. Will I be able to grow from a baby to a full grown Amargosaurus? And will I survive through all the challenges and the hurdles that I may face in this video of Path of Titans Survival Challenge? Ah yes, Sudo Expanse, my favorite of places where I don't want to be as a baby. This is also on the, the eastern side of the map and if my experience are uh, anything to draw on, then there's, there will be a lot of carnivores here. I decided right away to leave the eastern part of the map, knowing that there might be a lot of enemies around. And enemies doesn't just come in the form of carnivores, but could also come in the form of herbivores. My destination was the southern part of Green Hills, the perfect location which I felt would give me the biggest chance of growing. Of course getting there wasn't easy. Danger lurks everywhere, and you are not safe no matter where you are. The only defense I had as a baby was to hide. Even though the closest carnivores had cleared out, I was still unsure about going out in the open. Like I just said, my only defense was to hide, while hoping that my camouflage would do its job, and also that the other players didn't have their grass details on low. In other words, going out in the open during daytime is nothing short but a death wish, so I waited until night had settled. My destination was in sight, and I would soon be safe. Despite being only a small part of Green Hills, there's a lot of quest items here, and it is in close proximity of dried lake and whistling columns, so my questing would be rather efficient. Of course, the main reason I wanted this place out of all other places is due to high vegetation. For a small bebe, this would be most ideal for hiding. Thanks to no disturbances, and the fact that my questing was so fast and efficient, I continued growing without any problems or setback. I kinda think that people are over-exaggerating how difficult it is to grow on the official servers. I mean, aside from the easy PvE challenges, there are no real danger except the other players. And as long as you understand player behavior, it's not too difficult to avoid them. I must admit however that some of that knowledge are born from experience, so those who have played the game for a long time might just naturally know where people will go. Of course, even for the most experienced of players, some encounters are inevitable. Hi hats. Could you... not? Can you fly away? Uh, don't. Go away, please. No, don't you. Oh! Yeah, 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 I'm friendly, I'm friendly, I'm friendly. I just wanna have a snack. Just adolescent, I won't even drop them. Okay, good. Oh, I'm having PTSD from when Hotsick came out uh, for the first time and everybody was hats and ev everybody was attacking everyone. Come on. Soon to be subadult. This should give me subadult, I think. I hope. Come on. Give me subadult and I can call it a day. I think it's day 9 and you know what that means. I don't want to go uh, into the first task being, yes I'm subadult. Okay, now at least I kind of have a fighting chance if I should encounter anything. Like I just said, I was about to receive a task, for you see, 
In this challenge, every 10th day I will receive a task. This task could be anything, and I would have it until the next task, 10 in-game days, to complete it. If I did not complete this within this time, I would lose and the video is over. If I receive a task that tells me to play in a certain manner, and a later task contradicts it, then the newest task will overrule any conditions that may have been placed upon me. First task going to be a kill in Apex, right? I know it's going to be, I know it's going to be. Universe hates me like that, oh? You know, I'm not a crocodile and I'm okay with it. I'm not leaving land for anything. Having struck gold on the first task, I decided to just continue growing, as I didn't really have to worry about anything else. Once again, luckily enough, my days were rather peaceful. I either met up with friendly people, or people who couldn't really do anything. Hello you little two-legged freak. Is that for me? Is that so? I mean, I already done my uh, dried lake, my root quest, but your kindness are appreciated. If you come back as an adult later, um, remember this, uh, I spared you, it's not like you could have ran away or anything. Yosh, and I'm an adult. Well, um, I guess this place have, uh, has served this, its purpose, so um, I guess I know what I should do now. Stay and hide in a remote area to draw out the time. Classic strategy. What, I have a challenge to complete and I'm about to reach day 20 and this is a time consuming effort so of course I wanna, don't wanna take any risks. Day 20, it's probably going to be killing Apex. I can feel it in my bones, my Amarga spines are tingling. That's basically the same thing. Though I kind of already am full on both uh, food and uh, thirst, so and water, I mean. So I think it should be a piece of cake. It honestly wasn't that bad. Knowing what tasks are in that wheel, this was one of the more tamer one. Of course, just sitting around might not be the most exciting of things. However, the entertainment in this game doesn't come out just from combat. Oh no 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 no. I was uh, having fun looking at global, might have started a few things, can't really share that on YouTube. Let's just say the stuff said might not have been the nicest, which is why it's blurred. On the other hand, if both parties are rather mature, then you can spark some interesting debates. Take for example one of these topics, Ian Malcolm is a terrible dad, the Spinosaurus has worse identity problems than a 14 year old. Okay, these topics aren't really debates, but they were topics that was brought up. Don't worry though, there is one debate topic that I can safely share without any problems. Uh, just, you know, um, which Path of Titan creature, the official ones by the way, is the strongest one. I won't be sharing the result of that debate, however, comment down below. Who do you think is the strongest official creature in Path of Titan? Finally eat. Wasn't really that bad to be honest. Though I'm sure the next task will probably go to bowl me in the butt. Huh. Is that me? I did. I was um, dis, uh, disconnected due to inactivity not too long ago, but. Is it gone? Am I gone? Did that fix me? Oh, no it didn't. Um, okay, just out of reach. Listen, other me, there can only be one. Ah, this is taking forever. Can I, if I? Yes, like that. Yes! Oh, 
I better not log in next day dead. Day 30. <sighs> Am I about to get the kill apex this time? Who knows? Let's just find out. <coughs> oh? Give somebody a gift. So, um, in other words, you're telling me to go meet people. Hello? You... Oh, yeah, you're not friendly. Oh, oh. Swing and a miss. I was going to give you a flower or anything, but I guess I'll have to give you the sweet release of death. That can be interpreted as a gift, right? Oh. Okay, there we go. This is the second time you used that bone break. I know that the stamina drain isn't as bad on Das compared to the Rex, but it still drains your stamina by a lot. Again? Real uh oh. I wasn't looking where I was going. So the bone break doesn't really do much damage, it's only... I mean, it only gives me bone break and... As long as I keep him on a dis at a distance, then... It's not too problematic. Again, really? Now this player's gotta be a new player. You don't use the bone break this many times. You you're just wasting stamina. This is definitely a new player. He, he probably believes that the, the um, charge up attack also uh, deals damage, but it only does bone break. Yeah, and now he, he doesn't chase me too much because he's low on stamina. You know what? See, see and yeah, now he's uh, trying to gain stamina. You know what? I'm gonna I'm a teach you a lesson. As the more experienced player right now, um, I'm gonna show you why you don't use the charge up bone break that many times. In most fights, uh, whenever you lose your stamina, that is usually uh, the time when you're dead. So, um, yeah, uh, wasting stamina like that, not a clever move. Though, I can't really defeat him in a... Oh no, that is just not fair. Um, I mean, I still kind of want to... Okay, oh look, look at him. He, he's become a bit more cocky now he has gotten help. So, okay, I'm not gonna let you get stamina. Okay, uh, get away from me. Uh, oops. Okay, uh, we both missed. I'm gonna get a lead on you. And you smack your way. Um, this is going to be a bit more problematic now that it is a now that it is a two v one. So I don't want to lose stamina because it's a lot more dangerous to me. So how about we settle on a draw, guys? I don't know how low you guys are, but I can assume that the dash are pretty low. So, um, I don't kill you, you guys don't kill me, I say that, I say that's fair, right? A draw. So, I still, still have my task to complete. Ah, I guess I'll just have to find another one after I healed. Feeling satisfied with the results, I went off to heal my wounds. And lucky for me, another chance to fulfill my task would present itself. Oh, hi, Serato. You don't look that big, um... I don't know, are you alone? You could be with those other guys, if they are still around. Um... I mean, you're too small to do anything uh, against me now. Okay. You're only taking stuff for one person, so, um, and I don't, I don't see the others around anymore, so you must be solo. I can use you to fulfill my task. Good, good, he, he is collecting flowers. That's good, which means you will be needing this. Hey, hey, 
gift for you. Yes? We did. Can you not pick it up? Did he take it? I don't see it, so yeah, he took it. Yes, yes, yes. Task complete. Now I'm gonna head back to my place in Dark Forest. I know you're gonna do it. Just, just give me the kill apex. I know you're gonna do it. Now I don't believe this. You see, see, this thing is just giving me a false sense of uh, security. Like it's going to give me like uh, all these easy tasks, but at the end of the challenge, it's just going to uh, give like yeah, kill uh, kill an apex uh, at the very end, and I'm just gonna go, oh, despair. Even though I was locked away in my area for the next 10 days, I was pretty sure that I wasn't really missing anything important. I mean, as far as Impact Trader go, it was probably just the usual chaos. Day 50 and now is when the shit is about to get real. Now it's when I'm gonna get the kill an apex and my life is going to be awful. If I even uh, get to keep my life if I get to kill it. <sighs> you know what? Much better than moving to a hotspot. Singles write a song. Actually, I think I... I got something in store for this. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ooh, guys, 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 guys. Let me cook, guys. Let me cook. Hold on, I'm gonna call someone. What's up? Yo, so, uh, quick question. Yeah? So, uh, what do you know about VTubers? Uh, I know a little. Besides you, uh, I know a few others. Though I don't really watch their streams, just their clips. Mm, good, good. Good start, good start. Uh, who do you usually watch? <clears throat> Don't really remember their names, but I usually watch the ones with big tits. <laughs> understandable, understandable. Uh, but aside from visual pleasure, what do you actually know about VTubers? Uh, I don't know. They're virtual gamers or influencers. Nothing too different from normal ones, except that they use an avatar. True, true. Right, right. So, um, what I get here is, uh, you know some of the general stuff about VTubers, but you haven't really, like, fallen into the, the quote-unquote rabbit hole. Pretty much. Hmm, okay, okay. Um, then let me, let me just try and convince, uh, convince you to join us in the rabbit hole. So, uh... Listen, listen, just, just watch it. Bob Hawk through VTubers, young ones and seniors. Please have a look, I'm sure you'll get hooked. Focus your mind, I want you to know. Fun part of VTubers, let's go. Assemble all sims, I'm making it clear. The day of virtual people are here. Stop in the super chat train, no we won't. ASMR, 
ASMR stream, what a good time All of us thinking, making you mine QA stream, sometimes collabs and gameplays Oops, hit hit, no backseaters please VTuber hell. Welcome to VTubers. You will love it here. You'll financially lose. I don't care. Welcome to VTubers. Welcome to VTubers. Welcome to VTubers. Assemble all sense. I'm making it clear. Slapped it on some AI generator and eventually I got some catchy. Do you even know what you're even doing? Uh, at the moment, currently making a dinosaur video. What does this have to do with the dinosaurs? Shut up. Don't sweat the detail. In any case, you answered on joining us in the rapido? Yeah, I think I'm good. Well, I tried. After my failed attempt into converting my friend into joining the rabbit hole, day 60 had arrived. You know what? I've taken too many guesses and gotten too many wrong. Now I'm gonna say, I'm not gonna get the, the quest of killing an Apex. Like, I'm not even gonna receive any killing intended quests. I'm just gonna get a nice, peaceful, easy quest. Ah, scheisse. Well, at least uh, it is not an Apex. The big problem here is that low tiers are freaking fast. How am I supposed to kill something that can outrun me easily? I gotta need some plating here. Unfortunately, since I was missing a low tier to kill, there wasn't really much planning would help me to accomplish. First, I would have to locate a low tier to kill. But that's a whole nother problem. I did debate on if I should go to Grand Plains or Crater. If I wanted to find a low tier, those two places would be the best chances I would have to locate one. Unfortunately, with the chances of me finding literally everybody else as well, I decided to try the other hotspot on the map. I made my way to Green Valley, found a good place with a good viewpoint, and then just decided to wait. If I couldn't find a low tier by searching, I would wait until a low tier found me. I waited for half a day, then got bored and also hungry and decided to leave. I figured that the waiting strategy wasn't really the best option, 
So I went back into searching. Hello, Serato. You're not with uh, Rexy of, uh, on the other side of the pond, right? Though if you are, he seems a bit too busy at the moment. I mean, I would try and go for you. Stat-wise, I consider you a low tier, but... Oh wait, there's a concavenator in that. It most definitely is a low tier. But... You guys are both too freaking fast. I mean... Drake, maybe... Lure you over here, I can use the knockback on my tail and maybe knock you off the cliff somehow. There's a Sarko, I don't want you, you're not a low tier. Ah, why is killing a low tier so difficult? Hello, Trike. You're friendly, right? Oh, you wanna team up? You know what? With that uh, T Rex around here. I think it's good to have a track on my team. I feel safer now. Yosh. So the Rex on the other side and... Wait a minute. Um, you... When you pass me, you looked... Just now when you pass me, you look kind of smaller than me. Aren't Eo Triceratops supposed to be as fat or even fatter than the Amargosaurus? You might be a subadult, and if you are, then that may pose a problem. Well, um, I hope against my better judgment that you are an adult, and if not, then this is. Oh. Wait, hold on. You are dying way too quickly. Holy shoot, you're dying way too quickly. You were not an adult at all, were you? Oh shoot, oh shoot. Oh, uh, this was a miscalculation. This was such a bad miscalculation. I thought he was an adult. I thought I was safe, I thought he was an adult. Uh oh. Oh no. Okay, it's the, it's the weak bone break. Okay, good. I just need to keep him at a distance. Uh, okay, yeah, continue using those bone breaks. Just need to... Okay, good. Get out of here. Keep him at a distance. Oh, nice dodge. Okay, he doesn't seem to have a knockback with assist. Oh, nice dodge. Okay, he doesn't seem to have a knockback with assistance, so that's good. No. Concavenator, not now. Really, you two, Raptor? This is not fair. But then again, I was going to uh, team up against that Rex if that Shrike had been an adult, so um, I guess this is kind of comeuppance, but at the same time. I mean. Ugh. I think I should be able to outstand the Rex, uh, but now I gotta watch out for my bleed and stamina because of the conk. Because of the bleed, I can't move as I want, and this conk isn't going to let me go. And oh shoot, that does a lot. That uses a lot of stamina. If I can just get this concavenator, oh no, the Rex is uh, coming. If I just can just get rid of this concavenator, then maybe I can. I don't know. I'm losing stamina pretty bad. Yes, okay, the concavenator is, um... <coughs> this is not good. I don't know... If I have more stamina than... I can't move as I want either because of the bleed and... Wait, maybe... Okay, maybe if I get to a... Place with the rather steep hill, maybe I can use the knockback and get some damage through fall damage, maybe? Oh, oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, no. Uh, uh, 
Try again, try again. Maybe I can get lucky, maybe I can get lucky. Maybe I can get lucky. Well, that's freaking backfired. And there we have it, folks. I did not manage to survive 100 days as the Amarcosaurus on the official servers. However, I did make it past 60 days, which is better than the Allosaurus, actually. So, um, you know, only the second worst run I ever had. But then again, this is only my second failure, so, uh, you know, go figure. In any case, let this be a lesson on to always check and to know the power and limitation of your teammates. It might cost you a lot if you don't. With that, I thank you guys so much for watching, and I will be seeing you in the next episode. Later!